Hello, this is Pavel Kruglov, the manager of the facewear company producing face masks with filters. We often get questions how masks are different from one another, and we decided to carry out this unusual experiment. For the experiment, we have professional equipment and to be exact, particle analyzer, which counts the particles in the air. And we have created this air cannon, which has 100 mm ventilation tube and an air pump of 108 cubic meters. How are we going to do this test? First of all, we will measure the number of particles in this room. Then we will put the mask hermetically on the adapter this way. And we will place it inside the pipe. Therefore, on the other side of the pipe we will measure the results after each test and we'll compare those results to each other. Today, we'll test those masks. The first mask is a medical mask from AliExpress. The second mask is a medical mask by a Turkish producer. Third mask is a medical mask which is sold in Estonian pharmacies. Mask number four is a mask given to patients in Estonian hospitals. Number five is a surgery mask. Mask number six is a respirator class FFP1. Mask number seven is a respirator class FFP1 with a valve. Mask number eight is a respirator class FFP2 with a valve made by 3M. Mask number nine is a different design of a respirator class FFP2 with a valve made by 3M. Mask number 10 is a respirator made by 3M, class of security is FFP3. Mask number 11 is a self-made mask, made of one layer of cotton. Mask number 12 is an air filter mask with the claim class of security F7. Mask number 13 is a mask made by a local designer, made of two layers of cotton. Mask number 14 is a mask made by a Estonian producer, Made of cotton, it has a removable filter, filter class is not specified. Mask number 15 is a mask made by us for test of two layers of cotton. And mask number 16, this is the mask face wear that we produce with the filter EPM1. We will now put the masks on the adapter this way. We will be attaching all the masks this way. The air cannon will pass the air through the mask and on the other side, air analyzer will mark the particles that will go through the mask. First of all, we're going to measure how many particles are now in the air in this room. And all that remains for us is to turn on the analyzer and look at the numbers. By results of the test, we can see that one cubic meter of air in this room contains 5,600,000 particles in the size of 0.3 microns. In the size of 0.5 microns, contains 100,000 particles. In the size of one micron, contains around 220,000 particles. The particle of the size 3 micron contains 14,800 particles. 5 microns contain 2,500 of particles. And 10 microns contain 707 particles. Now we're going to test our masks and see how they will be handling their job. Each mask sample will be tested once and the duration of the test will be one and a half minutes. After that minute, we will see how many particles mask got through itself. Let's start with the sample number one. 
Now I will show you how to put the mask on the machine. For impairability, we will use a tape so that there is no air leakage into the pipe. And for insurance and the reliability of the experiment, we will wrap the pipe with a cling film. And we will do so with the every sample. Now let's turn on the motor and see what the analyzer will show us. Let's test the sample number two, a medical mask by a Turkish producer. We are now testing mask number three. That is a medical mask bought in one of the Estonian pharmacists. The supplier of the company is Semitron. Sample number four is a mask given out to patients in hospitals. We are now testing the sample number 5, a surgery mask. Sample number 6 is a respirator with security class FFP1. Sample number 7 is a respirator with security class FFP1 with a valve. Sample number 8 is a respirator with security class FFP2 with a valve. We are now testing the sample number 9. Respirator from a company 3M, class of security FFP2, type Aura. Sample number 10, a respirator from 3M, security class FFP3 with a valve. Sample number 11 is a self-made mask, made of one layer of cotton. Sample number 12 is from a local producer made from a filter material, class of security F7. Sample number 13 is a mask by Estonian designer made of two layers of cotton. Sample number 14 is a textile mask from local producer with a removable filter. Unfortunately, security class of the filter is not specified. Sample number 15 is a mask sued by us, especially for the experiment. It is made of two layers of cotton. Sample number 16 is the mask facewear, our production, with the filter F9 EPM1. And now let's test it.
We have tested all the masks and you can see the results of the experiment in the table. Which conclusions can we make? Even the most simple mask made of one layer of cotton is already providing some safety. And it is better than nothing. Be healthy and safe. Take care of yourself and your loved ones.